Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we will make a model of lead screw in SOLIDWORKS software. So let's get started with today's modeling. Take a new part, ok. Change the dimensions to millimeter. Take a sketch on front plane. Now take a circle command and give it a radius of 25 dia. Mm -hmm. Okay, take extrude feature and extrude it from mid plane at a dimension of 500. Okay, now take a right plane sketch, <clears throat> take a profile. Uh, this and join this ok now this is in taper make it horizontal it's ok now take a center line change it to construction now take a smart dimension select this give it a dimension of 10 this is 40 40 dia and this is 80 now give this dimension all of 50 and this of 20 <coughs> give it a dimension from start point hundred okay and now it's done select okay take a feature revolve boss Select this profile and remove. Now remember one thing don't merge the result, let it be a separate body. Now, like this, if you select this this will not get selected so now we have two solid bodies this and this the revolve body hide this body we don't require it at present now select this edge give it a chamfer of 3.5 into 45 okay now select the right plane sketch uh, straight first make the helix take helix command select this face and now select this edge convert entities okay it will make a helix Take a pitch of 25 and revolutions of 50. Okay. Now you have to take top plane sketch. Take a rectangle command. Take a line at center point. Select. It. it is getting constrained. We have to take a rectangle again. Select this and this this line. Take a rectangle number again. We have to be careful while making sketches. Otherwise you will make a mistake. 
give it a distance of 10 and this as 3 okay now feature exit sketch now take a shaft cut select this rectangle profile okay and select this profile the guiding profile okay so it's not get selected so now it's selected as it will start showing the cutting profile okay so the cutting profile is here now hide this helix and take a circular pattern take axis of rotation as this take a count of 4 and take feature to be patterned as cut shot ok uh, ok the screw is ready now show this profile and go to insert features and take a move and copy command select this screw make one copy of this ok now this is the copy this is the original one and this is the revolve body now we have three bodies now again go to insert features and combine we have to select subtract select this main body and body to combine as this so ok now hide this body now you can see there are internal threads being made for this screw now show now take this face sketch take a PCD of dia 65 and make, take a circle of dia 8 and this take a line command give this and this ok select this as construction this construction and this also as construction take a dimension of 45 ok take extrude cut feature select this hole and make a through wall relation so it's not get selected okay. take extrude cut this and ok now it's selected ok now take a circular pattern select this feature extrude cut and take axis of rotation this take a count of 4 ok now give a chamfer of 1 into 45 on all these edges it will be easy going ok so that's all for today's modeling if you like the video please do subscribe the channel and hit the like button thank you